Dylan, you claim you've been avoided, that all the big heavyweight names are not willing to face you. There's one man that's just like you, willing to fight anyone. Joseph Parker, Dylan White. Welcome to The Gloves Are Off. My desire is still strong to be champion of the world. You know, even though I lost the belt, that's not the best me. And I know that's not the best me. And we're here for the challenge and we're here to fight the best in the business. Life's about taking risks and chances. I'm a massive risk taker, I've always been one. I've been quite patient, quite persistent. I work hard and I'll fight anyone. I want to take chances, man. Dylan, welcome. Joseph, welcome back. Uh, Joseph, do you feel as though you're back in the UK for redemption? Yeah, I feel you know, the last time I was here, I didn't get the result I wanted. But now I have a new challenge in front of me. And the result I want for this fight is, is what I wanted for the last fight. I want to put on a great show and, and knock someone out. What, why do you, do you think you didn't get the result you wanted? I think I was too cautious. I didn't throw enough punches and didn't put on, on enough pressure. But, you know, from, from the fight, I gained experience. I learned a lot of new things or things I could work on. And I feel like when I come into this fight, I'll put on display. Dylan, what did you make of his performance against Anthony Joshua? I think he, his performance was cautious, but it was also cowardly as well, because after, OK, I understand it's a big fight, you need to be cautious, but six, seven rounds into the fight, you're in a home fighter's country, his world champion is golden boy. Six, seven rounds in, you know you're behind on the scorecards. There comes a time when you got to go after it, and I just feel that it, it was too much of a coward to make the decision that he needed coward to make. Coward is a strong word. You wait for this opportunity your whole life. I did beat in Joshua. When I fought Joshua, my shoulder went in the second round. My coach wanted to pull me out. I could have just said, I, I could have said that. I know I still had enough power to land that one hit a quitter. But unfortunately, I got stopped as the fight went on. But I could have just said, oh, my shoulders went, done what everyone done, produced medical records, had operation two days after. I said, oh, my shot went, that's where I stopped. That's why I think he was a coward. He wasn't hurt at any point in the fight. Didn't get stung or anything, but he didn't want to make the decisions to go after him. And then now, he's regretting it and saying, oh, I feel like I didn't do this, so I was cautious. Then, to me, that's a coward's mindset. Will it bother you? Him thinking you're a coward? I feel like when I fought Anthony Joshua, <clears throat> and when he fought him, I fought the better Joshua. What did you think of his performance? I thought he had a good performance, but... You know, his injuries here and, you know, he... he I don't think his fitness was the best yeah. from the fight, from what I saw. But I feel he put up a good effort, but, you know, in boxing, when you get caught, you can't change your me. You're a warrior. This man's questioning your courage. He can question all he likes, but come fight night, he, he's got to get the courage that's in me. We, we've heard this before. Yeah, we, but we, we've heard this before. Have you seen it in person? He, he had his own. He had his own country over doing the haka, doing this, doing that, and then he let them down. That's how I feel. He let them down. He didn't show the warrior spirit and warrior courage that I expected from him, from where he's from. He never showed that tribal instinct and that and that, that warrior instinct. I, I fought a smart fight. Okay. I could have done but more, the, but it's learning. I believe in that fight, his mindset was to go 12 rounds. That was his victory in that fight, but the first Wrong. guy had to get stopped. My mindset wasn't 12 rounds. That's why I believe you didn't seem too bothered at the end of the fight. Well, was, I wanted to fight, like... but, but the you... ref jumped in a few times. Yeah, but, but refs, refs are refs. I'm not he, complaining. He had... I didn't complain during the fight. Oh, I didn't you complain don't blame after the, the ref. Fight. Blame yourself. You should have gone after him. Don't blame the ref. Don't I'm make excuses. I'm not blaming anyone. See, so the way you're saying the ref jumped in when a I few beat times. You, I'm going to fight him again. Did you? Do you think? Okay. Do you think? Remember, you were unbeaten. You were, you were a big star <clears throat> back home. <clears throat> now you're in the queue like everybody else. Now you're in, in his position. How does that feel? How does that feel to, 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 to have somebody calling you a coward for a world champion? Um, I, I don't really take in consideration. You know, what I've been says. chasing you for a few years, right? I've you been have, out, have yeah. you? Yeah. But now the We've time's here. We've the fight many times. The time's here many now. Many times. You agreed to fight me at Copper Box. To a year and a half ago. I remember? Agreed. I didn't agree yes, to that. Yes, he did. I got it in video. Do you? Yeah. Show me. A couple of box. I don't. 
my brother is upstairs in the green room. We're okay, going to we'll, video. We'll look it after, me and you are saying... After oh, no, you, so you're yeah, saying... No, you, no, you mean no. at the boxing fight? Yeah, you agree. I agree you agree man, I said, no, no, no. I'll fight you. No, no, you agree, man, or man, or that you was going to fight me. Yeah, but who, who makes the decisions? And you. who, who, who makes you the fights happen? If you don't make the fights happen? decisions, you need to, did it, to did go and look at your team. Did it make sense to fight you at that time? You need to go and look at your team. Of course it was. it makes sense to fight you now. No, of course it did. Because the window's going to get closer to fight for world champion. No, 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 no. You know what it is? What you're desperate now. You let your, your family down. You let your, your, I don't let anyone let your down. country down. Life, and so all good. That's all right. That's all right. Yeah, and that's your mindset. You're set for I'm life. I'm here for the challenge. Just, here just, to... just don't be a coward in the fight and come and Who's fight. Who's the coward? You. A coward is a, a person that calls someone else a coward. No. Yes. That's nonsense. A coward is a person who doesn't show courage and he needs to show courage. Well, who got knocked out? Because I wasn't a coward. That's why you was a coward. You didn't want no, to get no, knocked out and take chances. No, no, no. Dylan, Dylan, do you think you'll be able to back yourself? Back up the balls, back up I your see. intention on this? I back, I only <clears> back up my talk. I got there and I give it my all. You know, I got there and I fight late on the line. You know, there's times when, when I, I can take these away, I never do. Are you trying to hustle? Because I remember Mike McCallum saying to Harold Graham, don't run. He no, got into Harold's head and Harold stood there, had a toe to toe with him. He's give him a man a chance, anyway. he shouldn't have given him. Anyway. So you're, you're saying to him, don't run. He's going to run. So do you need that kind of fight in front no, of you? No, Someone's no, going to no, stand no, and no. tell him. I've, I've had. Tricky, awkward opponent, then I got the job done. You know, if he gets some running shoes, I have to get some too. So I'm able to, to run a, and catch up to him, you know. If you can. What's your knowledge? Does don't that say about, you are going to Don't gonna worry run. about There's things you can do to slow people down, you know. Oh, are you going to move, are you gonna move when your ribs is busted? Are no, you going to move? It hasn't happened yet. Yeah, don't worry. There's a first serve. I'm not worried. This man's never been down. Everything. Do you think you're going to do something that nobody else has been able to do? Yep. Including Auntie Joshua? Yep. Different fight, a different style. And like I said to him earlier, I'm an animal. What happens if he manages to outsmart you? Uh, the thing is, you know what the great thing is? I'm an animal who is clever. Very, very clever. So whatever he brings, if he wants to do this boxing stuff, I can box. But I'm going to box, box fight. I'm going to box fight. I feel like you're a good fighter, and I'm a good fighter. But I could box. Okay. And boxers usually beat Did you not see his, uh, his okay. fight against Lucas Brown? Did I did not, see Did you not think it was good no, boxing okay. ability there? You can't, you can't say that, you know, it was a great fight. You know, and you knocked him out and it's the first time he's ever been knocked out. But a person that just stands in front of you okay. to get hurt. Okay. What are you going to say about that? Listen, I know what he's going to do. He'll come and try to fight for two or three rounds. And then he'll get on his bike. So we'll prepare for that. I'll train for that. I will prepare for that. I know what he's going to do. I've seen you in this place a couple of times now. Mm. I've seen you grow as a professional. Mm. Is it out of maturity? Is it out of uh, self-belief? Because you seem very, very confident of beating this, this man here. Yeah, 100%. Because? 100%. Where's, the because when, where's the confidence I've coming from my after he took AJ the distance? No, no, I've done my apprenticeship. I've done my apprenticeship, I've had the fights, I've been on the road, I've had the hard fights, I've had the tricky fights, I've had the slug fest, I've had the movers. You know, I've had the power punches, and I find a way. You know, and I believe that, like everyone else, he will underestimate me. Joseph, this time when we see a different year, will you go for it more? Because well, now you you're in the war, queue. Go to war. No, if you want to go, he's asking you a direct question. Don't look at me. Look oh, at I'm him. saying to you, if you want to go to war. Look at me, answer his question, he's asking you. Are we going to see a different year this time? Listen, I can move, I can box, I can fight, I can go to war. Mm. Whatever you want. Has your mindset changed now from being the golden boy back home, from being a world champion? Yeah, he's set for life. Like he said, he's set for life. That's, Has uh, it changed? That's a se I, I, separate I, I, topic I, I, altogether. I, I, I ain't set for life. I'm hungry. I'm still hungry. I'm, I'm hungry. motivated. I, I want to be champion again. Life. I'm hungry. That's why I'm here. I'm hungry, bro. I fight in other people's backyards. I'm hungry. That's fine. Um, I fight everywhere. Backyards, yeah, I don't, I don't, room, yeah. windows, everything. Dylan, you know, you know what? Let me, let me just... <laughs> let me just, just, <laughs> where the let me just say something to you. Dylan, where the fight is, I'll yeah. fight anywhere. Same, I don't, same I don't, as me. Let yeah, me just yeah, say something yeah, yeah, to you. Yeah, I don't know where the fight is for me. Dylan, yeah, when this fight was announced, people were saying, are you crazy? Why? You don't have to take this fight. You, you put yourself in a position mm. to fight for world title. Mm -hmm. so, so, are you crazy? Are you mad? Some say I'm crazy, some say I'm mad, some say I'm stupid. Some say all sort, but it doesn't matter to me what people say. It's just what matters is what I can see up here and what I know can become a reality. Joseph, is this a bad move? Um, you know, he's closer to fighting for a world title, but I think it is a bad move. I think mm. he, he took the wrong fight. OK. That's what I truly think. You know one thing I'm glad? You know what I'm glad? David Higgins ain't, 
ain't speaking for him for once. He's actually speaking <laughs> for himself. I was surprised when Higgins was on a chair behind him telling him what to say. It's why, good. Why, I'm, I'm, why, glad you're coming, I'm glad you're coming listen, at your shell and listen, speaking sometimes up. Sometimes people mature, I'm, I'm sometimes great. people speak no, their mind. I'm glad that you come at your I'm shell and you speaking. Straight. It's good. So why is this? It's a good sign. Why is this a great sign? I love it. Fantastic. You know, Higgins is probably upstairs crying now, saying, why is Joseph speaking without me? Sorry, Higgins is the man. Joseph? Yeah, Why? Why is it a bad move? I just feel that he's so close to it that he's going to make you know, take the wrong fight and lose it all. I feel I have a bit of speed, I feel I have a bit of movement. And, you know, I'm always, when I'm, whenever Timing I'm in a fight, I feel speed. like I'm always confident that I'm going to win. Timing and precision beats speed, remember that. I don't yeah. need to be as fast as you or whatever. Yeah, I just and need I to... have that as well. That's okay, that's good. But that's think, good. Yeah. You, seen... you didn't show any of these things in, in your last fight, though. Your biggest fight of your life. Biggest fight the, of my the life. The fight yeah. that could transcend you into. But that's, listen, we're, we're, we're not talking about the past. No, no, it's we're relevant. It's the last fight. That is relevant to me. It, it's relevant to me also. To me. It's relevant to me also. You seem like you've, you're have a different person from the last time we were sat here. Confident, self belief. You sound, you sound, you're more vocal. Well, is it because you've learned a lesson? What, why, why is that? Higgins is taking his leash off and, and sent his puppy to, to run quiet. in the grass. He's talking about Higgins taking his leash off. Yeah, Higgins didn't. I'm just sick up. of being quiet. Speak my mind. That's all right. Why now? Why now? Because I can. So what? What you couldn't before? I could, but I just chose not to. Did Higgins have an electric collar on you? <laughs> Did he just give you a little buzz? Are you uh, obsessed of with, with Higgins or something? Huh? Are you obsessed with Higgins? Yeah, of course. He's a bigger star than you, and you're the fighter. That's all right. Of course. I, I, you know, I don't. I don't need to be a star. Without Higgins, you're you're nothing. Yeah, no, he's my promoter. He does a voice. great job, and he looks after Higgins his fighter. Higgins is your voice. You know. Does this bother you? Is this winding up a little bit? That like he's he's basically giving Higgins, your promoter, your your manager, more credit than you. For... It only affects you if you let it affect you. He's trying to get under your skin. Do you know that? No, no I'm I, not I, trying I, to get under no one's skin. Maybe he is. Maybe he isn't. I'm not trying to get under skin. I'm not sure skin. what's I'm going factual. on in his mind. I don't say stuff factual. I'm not trying to get under. I don't need to get under his skin. He's a warrior and he's going to come to fight. Why do I need to get in his skin? Where does he go if, if in the idea world he loses to you? Goes back to New Zealand and live a nice life. Drink calm. Um, what's that drink called that you guys drink? The, Which one? The, Kava or Kava? Is yeah. that what you're talking about? Yeah, that's, he drinks that. He have a nice life. He goes on his people. That's, but that's if. Goes fishing. Big if. But, you know, he, so seriously, is, it, is his boxing career over? At, or at this level? <laughs> Listen. He's young. He's a good fighter. He, he can come back. Two losses don't affect his career. What are you saying? Yeah. What are you suggesting? <laughs> <laughs> Facts, fiction, or antagonizing? Your class is the underdog. Mm, of course. Does that bother you? The former world champion. You know, he's a New Zealand warrior. Does What's... that bother you? No, no, it doesn't bother me. I've been an underdog all of my life. Don't bother me. You know, everyone knows my life story. Been in the dog all of my life, you know, it doesn't bother me. Is that what makes you different from most of the fighters out there? Because you've always been an underdog. You've always had to fight for your position, regardless of what you do or... Yeah, you know, there's a few things. There's a few things my life story, what I've been fighting for, where I've come from, you know, and where I'm trying to get to. And I never had no, no easy touch. When I wanted my chance, you wouldn't give it to me. But now I'm giving my chance back into the big time. You didn't give me a chance. Yes, I am. Mutually agreed. No, I'm giving you a chance. You're not, you're not giving I'm me giving a chance. chance. I'm mutually agreed. I'm giving you a chance. David was the one that called I'm Eddie giving you a for the fight. I'm giving you a chance. I'm giving you a chance, my No, friend. you're not, brother. Yes, I am. I'm no, giving no, you a no. chance back. Facts, fiction, or antagonizing? Oh, I think a bit of everything. Anything getting to you? Anything bothering nothing, you? Nothing to fix me. I think nothing I say fix him as well. He's a beautiful young man. Nothing we I both, say don't affect him. I think we're both mentally he's, strong he's, and we can say whatever we want, you know, but what, what it comes down to is what's going to happen in the ring. How do you, how do you beat him? Me? Yeah. I box him. I fight him. I bash him. So you're a better boxer? You're a better fighter? He's, he's strong. Lucas, he's he's a, a is that Lucas oh, Brown? Your body. Ba bash him? I bash him? Yeah, he's Senate Brown. Is, is that, that, is that a New Zealand, Australian thing? Bash him. Thank you, so. Is he a stepping stone? Stepping stone. No. He's not a stepping stone. He's not a stepping stone. He's just in my way. And one thing I had to give you credit and respect for, there's no messing about. The fight got mentioned. You said, yep, we took it, we got it done. 
I give you respect for that. Same. I got respect for you for that. Same. That I got respect for you for. Are you surprised by that? No, I'm not surprised by that. I'm not surprised by that. He's just stank the place out, so he wants to he wants to come <laughs> back and spray a bit of air freshener in, in the building. He wants to open stank up the, the windows. Place out. But you're not surprised. You're not surprised. Yeah, that that's even good. worse. If, if, if he lost it six rounds, then he'd have been all right. But 12 rounds are stinking the place out. More you know? credit, credit. Yeah, I give you credit. You stand up for 12 rounds. Respect. But you said he was a coward earlier on. Don't mean because I respect him that he's still not a coward, does it? I respect cowards too. You know, <laughs> there's certain things that they do I might respect. I might respect his fighting style and the fact that he didn't take risks, but I could respect the fact that he decided to take another top fight straight away. Joseph, is your attitude here the same as what it was when you, you got in with Anthony Joshua? Because you've got man in front of you that talks like, this is a done deal, isn't it? He expects yeah, to he, win. He, no, he's good at talking. Some people are, some people aren't, but he's good at it. That's what I'm surprised. What's his name? Higgins is Higgins not in again, it. Eh? <laughs> yeah, where's Higgins? I'm surprised uh, Higgins is not sitting here instead of Parker. What have you learned from your loss to Anthony Joshua? What have I learned? Yeah, about yourself. About myself. Just don't be too cautious and just leave it all out there, he's... which is what I want to do here. When it gets tough, and I mean, you both got to dig deep, mm. who do you think wants it more? Who's got it more? I've, I've dug deep time and time again. I see. He ain't had no fights so he had to dig deep. I the have one actually. fight he had to dig deep, he didn't want it to. Which one? The last I've fight. I've deep many fights. If the you last fight, you should have gone after Joshua. Joshua's been too Don't cautious. Don't focus on just one Joshua away. You should have gone after him. There's other fights the last fight, many, yeah, You've had to dig deep? How many times yeah. have you had to dig You're deep? Going, what fight did you dig a few deep fights. in? What fight? Tell me. Oh, cut eye, real bad, busted eardrum, and another fight. There's a few fights out there that you don't know about, so. Okay. Facts. Okay. Facts. Okay. Okay, tell me you how you're being. You're a new now, you can add the <laughs> vocabulary. Thank facts. You. Thanks. See, Duke is going to be so. Glad I mean, Higgins going to be so angry. He's like, stop educating my guy. I need, to, <laughs> I, need, I need to keep him dumb so I can control him. Where is Higgins? So I can is get is, him is to he trying? You know what? It's, there's an old saying, divide and conquer. Now, he's constantly been pulling David Higgins in to this, trying to insinuate. Your man's not no, telling you things or whatever. It's he, called divide and conquer. No, it's not, Johnny. He's a fighter. I want to see him do well. I don't want to see him get messed about and... You, you know what it's like. You was a fighter. Fighters retire and they, they're not clued up enough or whatever and then they're returning that, where did this go, where did that go, where did this go? So what are you saying? I want to see him do well. Yeah, what are same, you saying? Yeah. What yeah. are you suggesting? I ain't suggesting anything. You make don't your don't own mind up. Don't worry about my setup. My setup is great. I'm, I'm happy for you. I have you. a promoter, I have a management team, I have accountants. I'm happy all good. for you, I'm happy for you. OK, let's get to fight night. How do you see this fight turning out? Well, of course, the only reason why I'm here is because I want to win. How? Well, it depends how I feel on the night. Go on. Depends where the punches land. Oh, this is the fact. Answer the question. Why do you beat no, around the no, bush? No, no, Stop no. going around I'm the bush. Around Answer the, bush. the question. All oh, these are the fight turning out. Answer the question. Oh, whoa. Are you Be strong enough to hurt him? Are you, are you, is it going to be a boxing him. match? Of course I can are hurt you him. I can box him, I can hurt him. I can knock him out. Which one would you prefer to do? I prefer to knock him out. Now we're talking. Silent. Now we're talking. We're talking the same lingo. Yeah. How do you see this fight turning out? If he runs, I beat him up. If he comes to fight, I put him to sleep. <laughs> has he got the power to do that? I've never. You've never been down. He, you know, of course he has power, but can oh. you catch me? <laughs> can you catch me clean? I don't know. You see, he, 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 listen, it's all good, man. I got that kind of power where I don't need to catch you clean. I will see. I got that kind There's of. There's one got, way to find out. I got that kind of stuff where I don't need to catch you clean. Well, you know. Talk is talk. What's I'm, your motivation, Dylan? Motivation, just listen. I want to inspire kids who have no future, like I did. I never come out of nowhere. I never had no future. I was just a fog growing up. You know, underprivileged background. Family of. Well, one of 12, you know what I mean? Um, I never wanted to ask my mum for nothing when I was young, because I always think my mum needed to give to the other ones. You know what I mean? So I went out and did what I had to do, hustle. I wanted kids to see that you don't have to choose life. If you believe in yourself and you work hard enough, you can achieve what I, what, what, what I achieve and gone to where I go to, and to become a world champion. You know, and this is why I'm willing to do what he's not willing to do. You know? It's a massive, I'm carrying a massive, Racks I come back, you know, there's lots of 
underprivileged kids, life you, you would never know about. <laughs> you, you know? You don't know. Life you would you never don't know about. You know, things you don't understand where we listen, come from. Things have been through what I've seen and what Anchai's ever to make, you never understand. Everyone you never has ever a purpose, understand. Different purpose. Never ever understand. Hmm? Has he got the right? Do you he, does, he doesn't know my life. He doesn't know me. He doesn't know my family, so he can't oh. say that. Okay. Okay, I'm asking you. My family was brought up in Samoa. So I fight for not only myself, for everyone else. So you didn't show that in the last fight? And the last three fights you haven't shown You keep talking about the last fight like okay, you're obsessed the last, with the last, last fight. the last three fights you haven't shown that? Yeah, you know why? I had surgery. Oh, okay. Yeah, like you, you had an injury as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, find a message. This is, a, this is the time when you guys can send a message out to one another and tell them your intentions. How this fight's gonna go? What's in your head? Well, bring me your best. Let's see if your best can beat me. Dilly? Teach me some Samoan. Teach me some. Hey, Marlo. What does that mean? You say hello. Marlo. Marlo, is he? And what? Hey, you, hey. Yeah. He might have hosted you there. Might not mean that. Well, whatever it means, I don't care. <laughs> I just speak some Jamaican. He don't understand. Teach you you some Jamaican. Yeah, say, say something. <sighs> what can I teach you? Something good. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> mm. Boys. I just think I'm thinking of bad things yeah, to teach you right don't, now. Don't so. Know, otherwise. So, what happens when you clash? Joseph Parker gets beat up. Whichever way he does it, whichever way he does, he's gonna get beat up. He's gonna get beat up. You know, he's gonna get beat up. It's it's my time, he's had his time, he's had his shots. It's, it's my time now. You know, it's my time now. Joseph Parker, what happens when you clash? I get beat up. Listen, when you get shirt, get cufflinks even... as well. Buttons are out of date. Nah, I have my own style. No, buttons uh, are out of date. You know, I start wearing three your... pieces as well. Oh, you, you... Look, you look like an old man. Even, I, right. even Iggins is wearing a three piece. <laughs> yeah. Style, brother. Style. I'll ask you again. I'll three buy you a three piece. I'll buy you one. I'll buy you one. Joseph? I'll buy you one. Shaking it. Yeah, I'll buy you one. No worries. I'll ask you again. Yeah. What happens when you clash? Well, he's, he's getting knocked out. He's going to get beaten. One of those. Beaten by points, get knocked out, whatever. The, you're getting knocked out. You're not going points. You're getting knocked out. Wow. Well, you're going to get well, knocked okay. out. Show me. Yeah, we'll see. You're going to get knocked out. Yeah, we'll see, out. we'll see. Boys, this has been you're a gloves off. Out. We'll see. You've done well. This is going to go on forever in the day. Out. Show me. Stop we'll it. You're going to get knocked we'll out. See. We'll you're see, we'll see. Show out. me. You're gonna get knocked up. I'll they, catch you on Iggy's your chin. Go, I'll catch you on your chin. Joseph Parker's never been down. Joseph Parker's <laughs> been down once. Boom. <laughs>